It's pretty disappointing, I suppose, that I haven't been told anything, Dennis, but, um, you know, uh, that's uh, the way it's been over the last uh, five or six weeks. What do you expect? Oh, I don't expect uh, any good news tomorrow. I think I'll, uh, I think I'll be getting some, a couple of poor phone calls tomorrow. Have you spoken to your president today? Uh, he left a message on my phone before he had to fly to Melbourne. So uh, he just wants to talk to me tomorrow, so wouldn't whatever happened. Wouldn't have been the only one? Oh, no, it's been, uh, it's been running pretty busy, but uh, uh, that's uh, the way things are in these times. Are you tempted to simply walk away from this mess now? Oh, no. I mean, it's been a, a pretty tough haul the whole two and a half years or two and a bit years. So, uh, you know, I think, uh, you know, the players deserve better than that. What is this doing to the fabric of the football club? Um, uh, the process that's been followed has been pretty average, I suppose. But uh, I think apart from that, the, the players and the, and the football staff have got to be commended with the way they uh, have held together. Yeah. What, what, about you, what about your staff tonight? Oh, they've been fantastic. I mean, they, uh, they can't fathom what's going on, so, and, and I can't help them much because I'm in the dark myself. But as I think, I think uh, with the rumours being so strong, I think we better, uh, you know, just expect the worst. Regardless of what happens, how will you look back on this time in your life? It's part and, part and parcel of footy, and uh, you know that you just want people to be up front with you, Dennis, and uh, mm -hmm. when it doesn't happen, it's, it's, uh, it, it hurts a bit, but uh, you know it's part of footy. So what do I say? If you're there on Sunday, good luck. Exactly. <laughs> good luck, Damien. See you later. Don't believe I said that. Gee, your heart goes out to him. Uh, how symbolic his little daughter there right at the end of the day. John Craig Hutchison, one of the leading uh, football journalists in Australia, has been uh, following this story probably more closely than anybody else. Craig from Seven News, thanks for coming in tonight. Nice, Good evening. Um, you've heard all of that. Uh, is he definitely going to be sacked tomorrow? Unfortunately, he is. Yes, the Fremantle board... But Fremantle board voted today to sack Damien Drum. Uh, it was a secret meeting held this afternoon. I understand the chairman, Ross McLean, voted against making the change.